Welcome back to Crypto Turner. On today's video, I would like to discuss Crow or Crypto.com, how it's currently performing and what we could expect during the upcoming hours and days. But before doing so, I would highly appreciate if you could smash up those subscribes down below. It will be highly appreciated, especially because we reached 1.6k. So thank you very much already. And I will be looking forward as well if you could smash the thumbs ups down below at the same time. So thank you and let's get started on Crypto.com's price action. So what I think is absolutely important is that if we take a look at the daily time frame, we have already seen multiple touch points underneath this descending resistance as you can clearly see on this drawing. What we did see is a major support on top of this major demand zone underneath us as well a yellow box. And we could see as well that this was a brief support and resistance in the past. So that is something I think is absolutely amazing because we are right now trading and finding support on top of previous support and resistance. So this is looking absolutely bullish for me. And if we zoom out a little bit further, we can clearly see that we have created right now a higher low in comparison to our previous one so that is for sure something i think is absolutely marvelous what else i think is absolutely important is that if we look at this descending resistance we are clearly right now breaking out above it and therefore we are seeing a clear trend reversal getting started on the crypto.com chart meaning that right now we could expect a support being found on top of these ranges and see further continuation towards the upside but even more important we could start seeing a higher high structure and as well higher lows getting formed during the upcoming weeks and months instead of seeing these lower highs getting formed underneath this descending resistance so that is absolutely something i think looks marvelous right now and therefore i would like to get started by looking at the four hourly time frame and see what we could expect during the upcoming hours so by selecting the four hourly time frame i already have made a few drawings first of all i did actually decide to make this symmetrical triangle why is this a symmetrical triangle and why i think it is actually a confirmed pattern is because we have already seen multiple touch points underneath the descending resistance but we have as well seen multiple touch points on top of this ascending support so that is for sure something i think does look very good and why this is as well a confirmed symmetrical triangle so i already took as well the measurement to see where we could perhaps be heading towards if we do see a clear breakout outside of this pattern as we have seen right now and where we could be even heading towards further and i selected this measurement tool and what you're seeing is actually a major increase of approximately 25 percent heading towards the 0.51 dollar cents and that is absolutely something i think is up very likely to occur so heading towards this target right above us is very possible within the upcoming days but of course during this weekend I am still doubtful that we could perhaps see a minor retrace or a minor correction on Bitcoin and therefore we could see as well a further decline on Crypto.com's price action. Well, let's look at the levels of support and resistance. Well, for sure right now, what I think is absolutely marvelous is that we did break out above this horizontal level of resistance at approximately 44 dollar cents the reason why is because if we look at previous data we can clearly see that in the past this was a level of resistance as well a level of resistance and even further back a level of support so therefore i think this is a very significant area to stay above of and if we manage to hold strong on top of this range we could create a bull flag and afterwards a major leg once more towards the upside heading towards our price target at 51 dollar cents another possibility is that we won't be able to hold strong on top of this area but that we will decline a bit further heading towards the 41 dollar cents perhaps and accumulate on top of this range for a while before being able to see further continuation towards the upside but of course right now we are still holding strong on top of the 44 dollar cents and therefore if we manage to hold strong on the top of this range it is very likely that we could see a major leg towards the upside getting started that will be very likely similar to our previous leg and that was a leg of approximately 9.6 percent so if we measure right now from the 44 dollar cents range 9.6 percent towards the upside you can clearly see that we will be breaking out above the resistance range above us and therefore we could see once more another stronghold getting formed on top of us at approximately 48 dollars and so if we manage to hold strong on top of this range see i like towards the upside managing to hold strong on top of the 48 dollars is a must 
if this doesn't occur, it is very likely that we could see a further decline heading towards a $41 cents where we did see previously a lot of volume being traded. We saw multiple levels of resistance underneath this range and therefore i'm convinced that we will manage to hold strong on top of this area and that it is for sure a major support zone underneath us as well i wanted to discuss the ema ribbon the ema ribbon is actually aligning itself together with the 41 dollar cents and that is clearly showing us that this is a major level of support underneath us so i'm not very doubtful that if we do not manage to hold strong on top of the 44 dollar cents where we are currently trading at that we will be actually able to hold strong on top of the 41 dollar cents and perhaps accumulate sideways for a while before seeing a major black towards the upside once more continuing the price action on crow and the trend reversal that we discussed previously during this video on the daily time frame Lastly, during this video, I would like to discuss the RSI and the MACD on the 4 hourly time frame, starting with the MACD. And what we can actually clearly see right here is that on the MACD, we did see right now a momentum loss. We are not anymore seeing a major continuation of momentum towards upside, and we are actually seeing, well, a minor accumulation on top of this horizontal level of support. So that is absolutely looking very good to me. But what I am a bit concerned about is that if we do not manage to hold strong on top of this area, it is perhaps likely that we are going to see a crossover getting started on the MACD and therefore see downward momentum getting created and a further decline on close price action instead of the scenario i discussed previously by looking at a bull flag and seeing afterwards a major lag of 10 percent once more getting started breaking out above the 48 dollar cents and perhaps managing to hold strong on top of this range as well so that is absolutely something that i will be monitoring closely but another possibility is that we will be managing to hold strong on top of the horizontal level of support where we are currently above and that we will only see a minor further decline on the MACD and afterwards another momentum wave towards the upside getting started. But of course, I personally think that is quite unlikely due to the fact that we are quite overextended on the RSI and that is of course why I will discuss the RSI right away with all of you. So by looking at the RSI, you can clearly see that we are actually breaking out above the dotted line on the 4 hourly time frame, meaning that we could perhaps expect that we are going to re-enter the purple range. And that is actually not very bad at all, due to the fact that that will be giving Crypto.com's price action even more space to see a further continuation afterwards. So perhaps the accumulation range on the $41 cents or perhaps a bit above it won't matter that much due to the fact that afterwards we might see a major gap getting created on the rsi and we could see once more price action towards the upside getting started and as well the strength increasing on crypto.com so for sure i am not doubtful that we will still see the price target of 51 dollar cents getting reached on top of us but perhaps we could right now see a minor decline heading towards a 41 dollar cents before we will be able to reach that 51 dollar cents target so for sure this is what i wanted to discuss with all of you what are the most important things discussed during this video well one of those things is that we can still reach the 51 dollar cents target above us at the white line another very important thing is that 48 dollar cents we are going to see a major level of resistance so therefore if we do right now see a further increase we would like to see a breakout above this range and create a stronghold on top of it otherwise it is very likely that we will get rejected and head straight back down towards the level where we are currently trading at and another scenario right now in crypto.com is that we are not going to hold strong on top of this 44 dollar cents level of support where we are just a tad above and that we might break down below it and head towards the 41 dollar cents range where we are seeing a major level of support due to the fact that we have multiple touch points on top or below this area so therefore i am actually convinced that this is a more likely scenario to occur and that afterwards we are still going to see a major leg towards the upside getting started heading towards the 51 dollar cents for sure so thank you very much for watching this video if you did enjoy the content do not forget to give me those big thumbs ups down below it will be highly appreciated and you will be supporting the channel by doing so thank you very much and have a nice day